Yo, 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 what's up? This is Jeremy from JJ Innovation Garage in the Peach, capital of the state, baby. All right, boys and girls. Oh, we got humid here in North Carolina, like super quick. Ooh, let's get down here to the square body. And uh, block sand. I block sand the uh, hood yesterday or last night with 320. Um, I got to get some things to uh get some footage off of my gopro and um go from there but um let me flip this around i'll show you what i got going on all right so got this blocked out with 320 now next thing would be is to uh block it out 400 wet and you see i got this light rack that I made, you know, so you can really, really make sure that you're getting everything. So I drive this truck. Uh, it's actually my boy's truck. You know, the other week we did the the C notch, and so now I'm debating on. You know, these are new bed sides. I could block the bed side out, but I think what I'm going to do is this right here. Um, I think I'm going to do is I am going to start stripping probably not going to do the I don't know I'm going to go ahead and take these drip rails off these little screws right here this is just from sitting underneath the carport that the guy that used to own it he passed away excuse me he passed away and it sat for years in the carport. So the sun come up like this and caught it here and caught it there on the other end. So I'm going to get a little small wrench, take these drip rails off, and probably go ahead. And this right here is a good brake line because I don't want it to leave, you know, being bare bones for too long. So if I strip this, get all this stripped down because. You know, it's, it's getting pretty bad. Um, so strip this whole roof top, right? Strip the roof top. The glass will get pulled out eventually, uh, but not going to pull it out. There's a dent right there you can see from something. So if I take my six-inch sander or my Dewalt with a 80 grit, I'll knock this whole top off. And once it gets knocked off, um, I'll uh, take the wire wheel and clean this out here. And then I'll run a piece of tape all the way across here. And then I will metal treat it with a, uh, it's SX now, it used to be DX metal treatment. And then I will uh, epox it and then this part will be done and then i'll uh go to something different um yeah i could blow the whole truck apart blast the whole truck with media glass let me turn this around could blast the whole truck tear it apart blast it and then but then it'll be down and out and i really like driving this truck um i uh i, I drive between this one and the other one um but then we'll go from there so today is sunday uh, I think it's the fifth. Um, got the Mustang painted last week. Thankful for that. So tomorrow, I will get back on the front nose of the Mustang. But for right now, we're going to talk about this C10. So make sure you uh, or square body. It's an R10 actually. So make sure uh, you subscribe. Drop some comments in there. Um, I'll answer your questions, um, and we'll go from there. And if you want to follow me on Facebook, shop's page is JG Innovation Garage LLC. Um, go on there and hit the follow button. There's a lot of content on there too. So remember what I said, boys and girls. Don't worry about the man up the road or the man down the road. Sweep off your own front porch. Worry about sweeping off anybody else. Just put God first. Let Lucy and Drag, peace up and chicken grease them out. Let's get it. Let's go.